Hello, all you magnificent people. Derpo the Magnificent here, and today we're finally back with Gross Code. It's it's been a while. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, just a whole lot of stuff. Honestly, there's it, it would take too long to explain what all happened. Um, but yeah, uh, but first things first. When we get back into the game, I'm gonna be farther along than ye than you'd probably expect, because I recorded an episode already, back before the Q&A, and then just never edited it, and then somehow accidentally deleted all the footage. So, yeah. But, here's what you missed. Nothing. Nothing at all. You didn't miss anything. I just attempted to do some side quests. I think I got one or two done, maybe. Uh, but then most of the video was just like an hour of me running around trying to figure out what the goddamn hell I'm supposed to be doing in this game. So I've decided at the end of that episode I told myself, you know, I'm just going to I'm just going to XP farm for a bit just just try and level up a bit uh, and I decided screw that. I'm just going to try and power through and just move on. Screw these side quests. I don't even remember what the side quests are. It's been at least it's probably been like near a month since I last played this game. Oh my god, there's so many that's right. Yeah, there's there's so many things and all of them are just like these, just, d d d none of these, are, d d all of these are like level 18 and 17, I got a couple of 13s and crap, but the, the thing is, is I'm 11, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing there, so I'm, I'm not gonna do that, uh, I'm just gonna go, I'm, j I'm just gonna go up to the world map, and we're gonna go all the way just to Bergen Trail, and we're just gonna move on through Bergen Trail, uh, and I'm probably gonna get my ass handed to me, but, oh no, no, I can, I can, I can semi-fight these guys, that's not bad. Just gotta remember how to play right quick. Okay, got it, we're good. Right clicking to dodge, which is really weird, but that's fine. Alright, no, yeah, I can fight these enemies. I can do this. Oh, really? Just do your charge, man. Come on. Nobody wants any of this bull. Look at that! Killed that guy in one go. Look at that. We're all leveled up. This is close enough. We're we're gonna move on now. I feel like maybe this is what I'm supposed to do. Maybe maybe I finally did enough side quests to just move on with the game. Oh yeah, that was the sea dragons! Those guys are absolute frickbags. Oh, okay, that's a really powerful attack. It's like a cool, like, delayed thing. Oh, and the sea dragon is shooting crap at us. Jerk lord. Okay, right, so... Uh... God darn it. Alright, so it does it the way I'm moving, not the way it... Got it. Frick you. Frick you. Alright, skip that. Get the health back. Healing items are... They're there. I'm not really sure why, but they are there, technically. Alright, and then there was up here, yeah, there was like the ice bunnies and all this crap. I have a lot of problems with this game. Oh, why did that rabbit turn into three rabbits? I'm not okay with this situation! Alright, how's this going? Rocky Climb, Base of the Mountain, Old Creator. What's my main objective? What is, what is the, I don't have a main quest, do I? Uh, okay, that's fine. Um... Yeah, I just remembered the entire last episode was just me trying to get this, uh, this quest here, which was going around the entirety of Bergen Trail looking for... Or not Bergen Trail, the first one, the first area. I, d I can't be bothered to learn the name. Um, was going around and finding all the plants there, and that took literally the entire episode, and then I figured out that this is a game-wide quest, meaning I'm just gonna have to get the progress as I go along. So that was really, that was a really, really good waste of an episode. So, yeah, like I said, you didn't really miss much. I almost feel like I would want to be playing this game in this universe rather than cross-code. Like, this game seems like it might be interesting, and yeah, that's technically what I'm playing, except that I don't get the choice that anyone else playing the game gets to do. I don't know. Alright, can I make that jump? Yes, I can. Alright. Oh, I leveled up again! Hello, Hello? Great, awesome. I'm level 13. I'm not sure if that's good. I mean, it is good, but... Yeah.
Ah, did you see that skillful blocking? I'm learning, guys. I'm learning how to play the game. Sure, I have to go completely silent and just bring all the commentary to a dead stop, but... Oh. Oh, I'm not allowed back up there. Alright, well, uh, I missed out on a whole lot of plants and stuff. Can I, can I jump down here? That looked like a jump that I could make. All of these look like jumps I could make, but the perspective is so jacked in this game. Uh, at least to me, to my untrained eye, as a snowman, it's got a health bar. We're okay. Let's go! It's got a lot of health. I'm not sure if I'm okay with that. Oh, it does a lot of damage. Ah, oh, well, so do the rabbits. Well, I just died. Uh, there's no point using healing items. Like, if you screw up this bad, you just, like, just... It's just better. Just die. Get it over with. Alright, uh, I think it'd just be better to start the fight with a, just a big attack. And then take out the rabbits first, because these guys are just straight bastards. And then we'll fight Mr. Man, get knocked off a cliff. As long as he doesn't do anything else, this should be fine. He's doing something else. Ah, that's fine. You can just break line of sight. Not a big deal. It's a big deal. There's another snowman over there, I just noticed. That's not good. Got a frosted carrot, though. I feel like I could just go to the store and get one of those a lot easier. Ah, oh, uh, I really want that item. He's not gonna let me have it, is he? Break line of sight. I just want the item. Like I don't, I don't give a crap about the snowman. I'll kill him, but I don't care. Look at me go. Look at me dodging. Oh, if only he didn't suck. Oh, if only I didn't suck. Jeez. All right, whatever. He's dead. Not a problem. Open up the chest. Guess what? It wasn't worth it. A perforated top hat. That might actually be worth it. Um, I'm level 14 now. Alright, I'm leveling up at an alarming rate. It's, it's kind of nice. The top hat's not a thing I can wear. <sighs> okay, that's... needlessly confusing. <laughs> Am I just dumb? Like, is the perspective really just totally fine and I'm just a freaking idiot? Because I feel like the perspective is just really difficult to look at. Oh, that is a lot of rabbits. Oh my god. Story. I didn't think it existed anymore. Alright, you made it, Leo. This is Bargain, the Snow Village. Wow. It's, uh... Well, it's there. Hmm. What'd you call us, Snow Village? I mean, it's a village and there's snow. Ugh. Anyway, if I remember correctly, the, uh, the next dungeon should be close by. You probably should tell Emily when you plan to enter, correct? Yeah, I guess I should. I don't know how to do that, though. Tranquil Town in the Mountain. Cool. And all of these have insides. I'm stealing your stuff. I'm doing it. I'm, I'm gonna find out how to steal your stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some hopping, some climbing and I'm gonna steal your stuff. Stole your stuff! It was just water. And I don't care for anything you have to say. Because you're an NPC, and you don't matter. Can I break these pots? I really can't. That's disappointing. Oh, this looks like an armor shop of some sort. Oh, you have a quest. Screw you. Uh, it's not an armor shop, so I don't care. We'll deal with quests when I get my ass handed to me, like I inevitably will. Not, not, a, not a huge fan of the music. Just in general, but in specifically in this area. And why are you building an evil snowman? Is it you? You like Mr. Cotton Snow here? I hate him. He tried to kill me. No. No, I no, I hate him. How nice of you. It took me a while to get him the perfect hat, but it just looks so precious on him. He looks angry. 
Look at that. He That's the face of a serial killer. I'm gonna die. That's it. That's all I had to say. Alright. Alright. There's an inn. Let's go to the inn. Let's go into the inn. It's a really good pun. It took a lot of brain power to think of that one. Uh, I can't actually get a room because I'm not a human being. Let me just hop behind the counter and... Hey, hey, you got a room? Hey, 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 hey. Seekers, welcome to Bergen. Oh, that's right. I can go downstairs. The mayor's waiting downstairs. All right. That's right. I'm supposed... Okay, well... I'm, I'm going in here. I'm... There's, there's loop. It's got a key. Never mind. Literally no point. I don't think I'll ever get the key or the ability to... Whatever. Hit. Cut C. Let's go. Oh, dear figures. Welcome to Berg. As the mayor of this town, it's always on his me to see so many visitors arriving dead ready. Of course, that's because this town's mine has become a part of the ancient track. Now, since some of you look rather confused, let me allow, let, allow me to quickly explain. It all happened several years ago. Bergen was founded due to the mining activities in this area. After some time, we discovered a temple of the ancients, hidden inside the mountain right at our mining location. At the time, we saw it merely as an obstacle. So we continued our mining endeavor, destroying the temple in the process. At once, until the tractor started to fight back. After a series of attacks, we were forced to give up on the mine. With the mine conquered by the track, it started to reconstruct the temple based on our own infrastructure. And that's how the temple mine was born. Now, why do I tell you all of this? Because I am an NPC. It is my only purpose. Bergen supports Project Trackwalker, so of course we will give you access to the mine. However, we plan to get back into the mining business. Wow, uh, my voice is just all over the place with this guy. When we lost the mine, we also lost equipment and technical documentation still hidden inside of it. All we ask of you is to recover those things for us as you traverse the temple mine. For more information, please consult the advisors on the ground floor. With that being said, I'll now gladly give you the pass to the temple mine. Thank you very much for your attention, and good luck on your journey. So has it been established what the track is? Well, there you go. I always thought the idea of a self-defending heritage site was interesting. Okay. Good. Got it. Got, got the mine pass. So yeah, uh, like I was saying, has it been, uh, like, established what the track is? What's the track? I know it's probably some sort of, like, evil thing that, like, does bad things, probably, maybe. But I don't... I don't actually know. I'm pretty sure I... they was... Uh, oh my god. Fine, I'll click. Jesus Christ. <sighs> hey, Leah. Hi. Guess what? Lucas told me he'd like to introduce us to his guild. Uh, what was his name? Oh yeah, the First Scholars. Uh, it seems they're looking for new members. Ooh. We probably shouldn't let them waiting for too long, no? Uh, sure. Alright. We should meet in Autumn's Rise at the Old Obelisk. That's a landmark, remember? You can just quickly teleport it. Yes, I remember how the game works, thank you. Our guild. Yep. Hmm. You'll meet a lot of players. I have to admit I'm a bit concerned. You remember that we must keep it a a secret, right? Well, I suppose you can't tell anybody about it anyway. Correct? In that regard, your speech mark function turns out to be quite useful. Yeah, whatever. So, as they say, just go for it. Bye. Alright, no need to be so huffy. Why do we need to keep the amnesia a secret again? These are all probably things that were totally explained within, like, the first episode or two, and I just forgot all of them because I've been not playing this game for so long. Where do I need to go? The obelisk? Fine. Hey, how's it going, Lucas? Hey, Leah. There you are. Uh, thanks for dropping by. Let's just go straight to the headquarters. It's to the northeast. Just follow me. So how big is your guild anyway? Not big. You're about to see yourself. Oh. Okay. The entrance is over there to the north. Here we are. Now, this is the entrance to a small and humble guild area. You'll need a pass to enter, so here you go. Guild pass obtained. This item gives you access to our headquarters as well. Now then, let's go. Oh, that's what this is. Okay, cool. Dope. And to the left. Oh, it's like a small village. Kind 
it is, yeah. yeah. I got some plants in here, thanks for the loot. Almost there. Oh, don't worry. I'm quite used to traveling far distances for disappointing outcomes. Here we are, the headquarters of the first scholars. Aw, oh, it's a cute little house. Told you we're a small guild, right? Well then, ladies first. Thanks. <laughs> ah, the newbies have arrived. This fellow here is Buggy. Howdy, Emily. Howdy, really? I'm sorry, that's my default greeting. Leah. Nice to meet you two. Lucas, Lucas. Bringing in the girls as usual, huh? <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever. The others are waiting upstairs. As usual? Don't take him seriously. I didn't plan on it. Lynn, the newbies are here. Now, now, Raphael, don't call them newbies, it's rude. Come on, Chief, you know I'm joking. Oh, could that armor be... Oh, my God. All right, whatever. I'll, I'll get over it. My, look at you two. Welcome to our humble headquarters. My nickname is... Hlin? Hlin? I ain't calling you Hlin. Thank God you have a nickname. But you can but you can call me Linda, or just Lin. And this is Albert. Good day. Pleased to meet you. Hi, I'm Emily. Hi, Leah. A pentafist and a spheromancer. Oh, how wonderful. If you two joined our guild, we'd have members of all five classes. Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's go somewhere comfortable. Such a cozy little house. Nothing like I had imagined it. Thank you so much. It's like the house I always wanted to own. Uh, now, of course, it's not the fortress that many people expect. Ah, uh, but really, the few... But really, the few of us who... But really, the few of us wouldn't know what to do with all the space, eh? Ha, huh, yep. Also, it's not like we could afford the castle of our dreams. Yes, yes. So, there's just four members right now? Not quite, dear. Someone else just joined too, not long ago. But he isn't around at the moment. So that makes five members in total. And you two just started playing, right? <sighs> Alright, so the other guy who joined is green-haired dude. Mm-hmm. We just reached Bergen. We're about to enter the mine. Ah, wonderful. The first real dungeon. It's always something special. It's the first time you'll be entering a heritage site of the ancients. Oh? What's that? Why, ah, it's what we seekers are looking for. We try to solve the secrets of the ancients, right? Each heritage site includes a few pieces of the big puzzle. Oh yeah, the plot. <laughs> God. That's right, dear. Did you know that the full secret of the ancients has yet to be discovered? Really? Oh yes, they're so crafty about it. The official path of the game will only tell you so much. They keep releasing new quests that will reward you with more information. But the puzzle has yet to be completed. And yes, that is what our guild is all about. We are the first scholars and we study the ancients. We want to be the first to unravel the secret. Ah, I see. And now you understand why our guild is so small. <laughs> Hush, Raphael. Well, I think it's nice to be in a small guild like this. There's just too much stress and responsibility with the big ones. I hear you, man. I think it's nice. Right, Leah? Sure. Leah, my dear, you've been so quiet all this time. Is something the matter? No, not at all. Oh, uh, she's just really shy. Anyway, I'd be glad to join. You too, Leah? Yep. So, where do we sign? Now, now. We have a small tradition here for new members. A quiz. A quiz? Oh, don't worry. It's very simple. We want to test your knowledge of the Ancients. But for that, I'm afraid you first need to complete the Temple Mine in Bergen. Just make sure to read everything in the Heritage Site and you should be well prepared. <sighs> Alright, sounds good to me. Come on, Leah, let's go to the dungeon! That's the spirit. It was a pleasure to meet you two. Feel free to drop by whenever you like. Oh, and I suppose now is a good time to share contacts, too. Alrighty, tell me when you're ready for the quiz. Greetings, Seeker. Ah, I see you acquired the Mind Pass. Allow me to lower this barrier for you. But before you go in, a warning. Some monsters inside will weaken you by causing chill and burn. Should that happen, drinking water will help you recover. Here, take some. 
Oh, that's what this is used for. Okay. Please stay safe and be prepared. Godspeed. Thanks. Alright then. Here comes a big one, Leah. Hmm. Looking at your stats and level, do you really think you're ready yet? I think Lucas mentioned something that our stats should be around 60. Oh, well, there's a, there's a thing here. Can I, can I buy equipment here? Welcome to the Bergen Mines. Uh, thing with the last track. That doesn't matter. Cool. Can't go back there. Probably need to access that quest to be able to get back there. All right, so I guess let's just head back into town, see if we can get any items. I know that there were at least one or two things that we could trade for. I'll yeah, we'll just buy that for now. For better or for worse... Just gonna do it. Let's just go. Yep, I understand. Yes, let's go inside. Good luck, Leah. I'll be waiting at the end. You got it. All right. Crap hit the fan. Dead people. As gone. Immediately whack their corpses. Oh, good. There's ice. That's fine. Is a pickaxe. I need that. Can I not climb these boxes? Oh, I can. Okay. Yeah. Laser pickaxe. This is literally the only way we can go right now. Wait, can we push this? Oh, we can push it anywhere. We're not confined to the tracks. Well. Ah, I see. Yeah, it definitely just totally is that simple. Okay. And now we have a... Alright, cool. Moving on then. Alright, so those are switches that we can turn on and off. Got it. Alright, cool. See, I like this. This is cool. I am totally okay with these things. These puzzles are nice. Alright, and I assume the mine key goes here. Yep. Oh! I'm glad I figured that out. That probably would have driven me crazy. Uh, alright. Draggy blocks. Ooh. Alright, well, this is where things start getting difficult, I assume. There we go. That should be it. What? Oh, there's that! Ah, frick. Oh, that's, that's a really easy, simple fix, though. Put that there. We're good. Okay. Got it. Cool. Puzzle solving. Hells yeah. Ah, and some battling. I can do this. Ooh. Well, what the heck is that? Oh, that's not a dead person. It's a it's a big scary thing. Okay, good. They have breakpoints, though. Wow! Breakpoints is absolutely what you need to do. Alright, interesting. G. B1, B2, B3, B4. Got it. I don't, I don't know what those are for, but... Ah, it's an indicator of the elevator. I figured. Ah, god. I mean, yeah, of course, now that I know these are enemies. They're not too bad. They're not they're not too hard. Okay, they do multiple things. They don't do a huge amount of damage either. I think yeah, I think the reason they're so tanky is because they have a break. Yeah, okay. Ah, 
Not sure when the break occurs, but it seems to be like sometimes after they hit a thing, and sometimes it's not. Dunno. Not sure what makes them break. Is it if they don't hit a thing? I, I don't know. I'll take it, though. I did it. I leveled up. Let's take this elevator. Uh, B1's our only option, so let's go. Alright. Alright, so dungeons. This is where it's at. This is where I like the game. Another laser pickaxe. Interesting. There's also a chest. A couple of bug shells. Good. We needed those to trade with a little bit later on. Or earlier. It was one of the things we needed. That's not a thing that we can access. That's okay. Uh, and we don't have a key. Huh. Interesting. Oh, there's a door here. Oh, it's Lord. Okay. Alright. Well, uh. Cool. Works for me. Uh, just for my sanity, I am gonna have to hit that there. Ah, that that's nice. That shows me exactly where the bomb's gonna go. Super useful, that. Got it. I don't think I can actually get it far enough to get over there. Nope. No, I can't. That's a disappointing. Okay, so the orange ones... Wait, seriously? Can I not get that over there? Oh yeah, hitting it again just makes it explode. Hmm. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. Nice. Alright. And then I'm not sure how I'm supposed to get that there. No idea. to blow it up myself. Cool. Good to know that that's a thing. Alright. Gonna fight enemies in this room. That's good. That's a gate that's gonna close. Yep. Alright. What the hell is that? Alright. So it appears that statuses work like they do in Dark Souls. Oh, that's scary. So yeah, they have to like fill up a bar... Oh, nice! The statuses have to fill up a bar before they actually start to take effect. Also, it looks like hitting these bombs is going to be the fastest way to kill these guys if we can actually do that. Oh, he broke himself! I'll frickin' take it! Oh, that actually isn't that good. That's a shame. Boom. Got him. I'm liking this. I'm liking this quite a bit. This is where the game actually shines. Six golden satchels! Alright, that's 6,000 bucks right there. Not bad. Alright, what we got? Let's activate that. Which drops a thing, which spawns this, which lets us smack that, which lets us go this way. Awesome. We can't go that way yet. Alright. Now we are combining the push blocks and the bombs. Cool. Which lets us get up there. What a shot. <laughs> I'll take it. I'm not sure if that was exactly the way I was supposed to do that, but... I'll take it. Oh no! Scary bugs! Ah! Oh, I hate them. Oh, I dislike them. 
Oh, I really don't like these. They're very, very tanky. I, I don't like any of them. I don't like any of this. I disagree. Oh my god, they're tanky! Bomb is always good, though. Wow, they're actually really easy to lead into the bombs. Good to know. Huzzah! We got another key. Yee, mine key. It is mine key. That's a really good joke. Alright, moving on. I don't remember why we need the, this key. We're just gonna go back and hope that the option presents itself. That's right, we needed it for this thing. Bloink. Alright. Let's move on. Ooh, okay. See how this is going. Alright. Cool. Seeing where this is going. Ooh. Alright, alright, alright. That'll explode that. Noise. Then we can jump on there. And then get here. And wait. Good thing I figured out about blowing the bombs up early. And get the mine key. Awesome. And now we can move on. See, I like this. I like the dungeons. The dungeons are really, really cool. Just straight up takes me right there, and I have a key, so. Cloink. Okay. Probably want to curve around there. Nope, we didn't want to do that. Okay, now we want to leave that. Unhit. Now hit it. There we go. Hit it again. Okay, we don't need to hit it again. That's fine. Perfect. Move it along. Oh, the, the boxes we can blow up. Yeah. Again. Good. I remember these things. These are good things to remember. Because otherwise, that would probably be a problem. And there's another thing back there. Is it a laser book? Bet you it's a laser book. It doesn't matter, I've hopped to my doom. Mining docks. A little bit less of a laser book. It's probably a book about lasers. I will have moved this. Ah! Look at this. Look at me go. Look at me solving puzzles. Oh, wait, how do I... Nothing fits through this gap, not even me. So how do I get this box over there? Oh. I'm an idiot. <laughs> We're good. Oh, it's a big lad. Oh, it's a very big lad. Oh, not a fan of that. Oh, I don't do any damage to him. Oh, we gotta stun him by hitting him when he's doing that. I get it. Did a lot of damage there. Good. Very good. Just tank it. Alright, we did it. Back to the elevator. Yes, please. 
Oh, okay. Hey, Leah, how's it going? I just needed a short breather. This dungeon is pretty long, no? Uh, it's not too bad. I've been going for like, what, five, ten minutes? By the way, did you see them too, right? You know, them. The bugs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I saw them. Ugh, I hate those things. I mean, they're huge. Ah, but also quick and twitchy, and there are just so many of them. Ugh, yeah, I really don't like bugs. Pardon. I guess I just felt like talking about it. Anyway, those things will not stop me. This race is still on. Alright, well, I'm gonna kick your ass. Oh, we're gonna get fire powers by the end of this. I just know it. Smash all the eggs, though. I see an alien. I know how this goes. Oh, I did. I. I, I collected all the things in Bergen. Okay, cool. Cool. I'll take it. All right, so we got two ways to go. Down is first. How's this one? Alright. I, I did it. And there's also a way to get up there, which is, uh, you, you just hit these. But, I don't have a key. Oh well. Dope. Moving on. Oh, this is... Ah, fighting on ice! Ah, uh, that's not good. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Alright, that break lasts a really long time. Good. <laughs> wow. Broke that guy mid-run. Ah, these guys. Oh, and the bombs just keep going now. That's a problem. Let's deal with the big boy Bronson here first. He's not even big. I can't call him big boy Bronson. Never mind. I got a lucky hit on that. Oh no! Okay. Didn't miss the break. Okay. Got him. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Yeah, I think I am definitely sufficiently leveled for this, especially since I just leveled up again. Awesome. Oh, and there's another laser pick. Don't know what these are for, but I'm gonna collect them. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to be like reading stuff or something as I went along. I definitely am not doing that. Oh well. Oh. Fire. Oh, and dudes! Okay, so yeah. Them running into the wall is what's causing them to not run. I 
stand now. I like that. And if we just stand on it, we just have like a constant flame. Alright, I'm down for that. That's really cool. I gotta say, I think the combat is probably my least favorite part about this game. At least so far. Maybe it'll get better. Maybe it won't. Dope. Is there anything back there? There's definitely things back there. Oh, but that's for... Yeah, it's for... Pow. That's not what I meant to do, but I had to do that anyway, so may as well. Put up that big old chest. A furry cap. Okay. Click the button. Get us a flamethrower. Oh! That's really cool. Wow. I really like the creative things that they do for the puzzles in this game. <laughs> yeah, that's really, really cool. Um, <laughs> this, this is some genuinely interesting puzzles. I really enjoy these. Look at that! Look at that! That is so cool. Alright, got lots of things, but most importantly, we have a lad. We're supposed to have him throw a bomb. I'm not a fan. That's the. So far, I don't like that. Chuck another bomb our way. Yeah, reflecting that actually does damage. That's cool. We don't even need the fire. We just gotta wait near the door until he does his stupid bomb attack. <laughs> Do your bomb attack. Come on. Thank you. I will take the key now. Never mind, we have to kill him now. We almost died there. That would have sucked. Got the key. Out the door. I don't remember what the key is used for. It doesn't matter. Let's go this way now. More ice. Party. Ooh, melting all the ice. Down with that. A couple more ices. I'm just gonna get some fireballs around. Hope that I accidentally happened to hit some ice. Seems they thought of that. What a shame. Ice platforming. Surprisingly not terrible. Ah, I was hoping we could just kill it in one go. I mean, we basically did, so that's good. Oh man, we're wasting time here. Damn it. Oh well, they don't actually move, so that's good. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, interesting. Damn it. 
can't spin to jump off ledges any better. There we go. Smack the eggs. Always smack the eggs. Uh, oh. Oh, we got us a battle. Oh, it's these boys. Oh, I bet they're super susceptible to fire, aren't they? Hell yeah, they are. Ah, gosh darn it. Trying to put it too close to me. Had to focus there for a sec, but I got it. Got us another key? Alright, so we're up to two keys now. And another chest. A few more items as well. Some vanilla ice cream. Oh yeah, I forgot drinking water will, like, get rid of the status effects and stuff, but it's not really needed. That's such a simple thing, like putting keys in locks, but I love that you have to, like, bank shot them. That's really cool. Oh, it's another boy. Oh, it's the boss. Oh, really? Ha 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 ha, really? I was supposed to hit him in the back, and I didn't do that. Second phase. Now it's 
gonna start doing scary things, I assume. Yep, I don't know what that is. Oh, it just does a lot of damage to me. Cool. I really have to actually dodge that. Oh my lord, that's bad. It's not that difficult to dodge, it's just... Surprising is all. Yes! Alright! Beat the boss first try. Hell yeah! Blue orb and a bug shell. Oh, and a couple other things. Metal Gears and a Blue Orb. And, was that two levels? Did we just level up twice? No, we just, we're level 17 now. Awesome. Which means we get a new thing. Oh, it's gonna be firepowers. Heat mode activated. Hells yeah. Playing with fire. Oh my god. Element load is displayed on the element load symbol. If your element load fills up, you reach elemental overload, which temporarily blocks the use of all elemental modes. Element load will steadily decrease in neutral mode. The best approach is to quickly decrease your load to deal damage in neutral mode. Okay, I understand how that works. This is huge. Oh, I get 16 of those, though. Okay. Alright, well that... That's a huge amount of stuff that I just unlocked. All right. Well, holy crap. I did it. I, I, I beat the first dungeon. The first real dungeon has been absolutely decimated by me, the man. Uh, and uh, there, there's a fourth floor, apparently. Don't know why that's not accessible, but that's probably a secret or something. I don't know. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna flamethrower my way through here, and... Oh, there's bugs and crap. Oh, but it doesn't matter, because we can easily kill them. Ha 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 ha! Get destroyed. I am almost elementally overloaded. Yeah, that's bad. Oh, and I just straight died, so that's nice. Alright, anyway... Uh, I need to end this episode off here. So you need a break from that gloomy mind, alright. What do you mean a break? I- I beat it! I didn't beat it. Alright, well, either way, I- I need to save the game here. And just- And just chill the heck out. And- uh, We did it. We made progress. We, we made progress, I played the game, and I got to a place that I liked. I like the dungeons. I really enjoy the dungeons. The dungeons are really cool. Um, so, yeah. I, I'm, I'm so glad that I finally found a part of this game that I enjoy, because I was really starting to think that I wouldn't enjoy any of this, and that everyone was somehow wrong about this game. Oh yeah, we need the big old key to get in there! But we never got the big old key. The boss didn't... Weird. Alright, well, uh, I'll figure out what to do with that later. Okay, anyway. That is going to go ahead and do it for this episode of CrossCode. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have a magnificent day. Derpo the Magnificent out.